Hey guys, Saving with Shay. Listen, quite a few of you guys wanted me to do a video on um, flavor wiki, flavor wiki, wiki, however you want to pronounce it. And I was trying to really wait to give myself a chance to get kind of used to the app. Um, I like to do the whole process from start to finish, submitting receipts, um, cashing out or whatever, so that I can give you guys the complete, you know, tea or whatever on the app. And so that's why I was kind of waiting. But to be honest, you guys, there's not a whole lot with this app. It seems super duper simple. I mean, I keep saying app, it's not an app, it's a website. And so you go to the website, you sign up. Now it did take me probably two, maybe even close to three weeks before I actually started getting surveys that I could do. Um, and so with the app, Basically, you go to... I'm going to see if I can do a screen record for this. Um, you go and you sign up. Again, it does take some time to actually, you know, generate some surveys um, for you to do. You have to qualify for the survey. So you do a bit of a pre-survey. And if you qualify, then it'll open it up for the surveys for you to do. So like, for example, when I did the one on the Oreos, it was a cookie survey for like a pre-qualification, <laughs> pre-qualification. Um, I got accepted or whatever. And then it opened up to like, there was like maybe five or six different Oreo um, surveys that I could do. There was one for the, the uh, little mini, um, the little small king size uh, pack. There was one for this this super size box. I, I guess they would probably have it like maybe Costco or like maybe like Smart and Final. They had the um, the family size packs I shared with you guys for the vanilla ones and the chocolate ones. And then they had one for something else. There was another one as well. Um, and so you could do the surveys for each individual one. Um, and then you basically, you go and you purchase the exact product, you submit your receipt. Now I have been doing each item individually. I've bought it on, on its receipt all by itself. I'm not sure if it has to be purchased by itself. Like I know with field agent, it'll specify if this item should be purchased by itself or if it can be purchased with, with other stuff. Um, so I have been purchasing everything on its own individual receipt. Um, so yeah, so you buy the product, you take it home, you start your survey. It'll basically walk you through everything that you need to do, ask you questions. Um, you'll have to, uh, take a picture of the product with you either thumbs in it up or thumbs in it down to take a picture of the receipt. And, um, yeah, it, it's really, really really easy you guys I consider it to be pretty um, user friendly um, there's only one page that I go to to be honest and that's the survey page as far as payment it goes to the email address that your account is under um, so you have to have a PayPal under that email address or have that email address or, or have that email address basically linked to your PayPal and as I told you guys before I have one PayPal account. Well, I actually have two. One I don't use as much, but my primary PayPal account, I probably have six or seven um, different email addresses linked to that. So I have email addresses for all my apps. I pretty much have different ones. As long as you have that email address linked um, on your PayPal, you should be fine. Now the payment says up to five days. The first deal that I did, which was the pancakes and the waffles, that took five days. It may have even taken six days. Um, but the cookie deal took two days. Like literally, I had the money in my account in two days on my PayPal. Um, so let me try to go and open this so I can record and kind of show you a little bit of something in the app, on the, on the site. I keep saying app, but it's a site. All right, so Flavor Waiki. Um, this app is just, I mean, it's just app. It's super easy, you guys. Like, it's so easy. Like, right now, I don't have any surveys that I can do. I'm not sure of what day they do post new ones on there. I check mines every day. So these are the surveys that I have on mine right now. Um, 
and none of them I don't have any any that I can do right now and I have two pages like this all right none of them I can do it just shows what's completed and um, all of the other ones on here are already um, survey times expire I believe it gives you five days to do your survey once it's accepted once you buy the product you have five days to get it done um, otherwise your time will expire and you can no longer do it all right so um, yeah but it's pretty pretty easy and then it goes into your um, into your PayPal um, and again this is the only page that I access is this page here um, but yeah that's basically it you guys it's really easy I didn't want to make this big drawn out video um, but it's a super super easy one to use now when it comes to sharing the surveys like once you've done them, like once I do it I can share um, the survey with you guys and if you guys click the link and you guys get accepted to do it um, then I get some type of little you know break off or whatever for you guys doing it um, so I guess that's kind of good that you can share the surveys with other people so in essence I feel like it makes it easier for those of you who are new those surveys available for you sooner than if you were just going in there as a strictly as a newbie like myself um, it wouldn't take two weeks um, or three weeks um, to do to, to get the surveys for you the other app that I wanted to mention really quick and this is gonna be super brief you guys because literally one of you guys mentioned it to me like a week ago have I heard of this app it's Alexa um, and I just automatically thought Amazon I was just and I, I looked into it I didn't find anything on it but then um, someone posted a video on Instagram on how to access the savings but so far basically you download the app um, you have to have an Amazon account um, and it's it, it to me it seems exactly identical to coupons.com like all of the offers on there are the same as they are on coupons.com all offers have to be activated prior to purchase um, and then only thing about it is it goes into your Amazon account so it basically is added to your Amazon account um, and you can spend it through Amazon so for me personally I don't use Amazon as much um, but I thought it's still a good deal for those of you who use Amazon I thought if you wanted to do maybe do brand club Amazon deals you could always convert it and use that to pay for it and then it would be converted back to cash I like the idea of coupons.com because that goes back to cash and again I don't use Amazon that much um, but I thought you know I do have to buy ink and I do have to buy printer paper so those are two things I could ideally get through Amazon and use my um, spending or my uh, my balance for that but again I haven't really used the app yet I do want to do um, submit some receipts to it um, and kind of see how it goes and then I'll be able to do a follow-up video for you guys and let you guys know how it worked out um, let me do a screen record really quick actually yeah let me do a screen record really quick and kind of just go into it just a little bit briefly all right so this is it right here Alexa so only tab that I'm using for this is the shopping list at the very top as you can see it says 112 items I activated every single offer available so I'm gonna click on that these are all the offers that I have available as I scroll through you can see they're exactly like coupons.com identical all right identical um, identical okay you can submit your receipts you basically let's say I uh, go down let's go back down we're gonna click um, savings and then where it says um, where it says get paid we're gonna click that and then we're going to redeem so you're gonna click redeem we're gonna submit our receipt we're gonna scan our items exactly how you do it on the coupons.com app all right um, I'm gonna do this not right now but I'm gonna do this 
for some receipts that I did today just so I can share with you guys in my follow-up video how it played out because um, if it works out this could be pretty good for us um, especially those of us who use Amazon a lot um, those of you who only have one coupons.com app but you want to be able to do a deal more than once you could do it on coupons.com and you can also submit it um, on um, on the Alexa now from my understanding you can't do both you it's exactly like coupons.com so you can't redeem offers that you've used a coupon on and you can't redeem an offer on coupons.com and on Alexa but I will try it for you guys and see what happens because I'm just curious I am just curious I feel like once I do it on coupons.com that the offer is probably going to pop off of Alexa but I may do it on Alexa first I just want to see how it's going to play out but other than that you guys that's basically it um I came out to Walmart to do some deals um because I had a midweek and it, it was weak it was 10 offers for a dollar but I went ahead and did it so I will share those deals for you guys when I do my weekend so when I do my weekend um, Walmart I bought a video I'll combine my weekday and my uh, my midweek and my my weekend together uh, because there's some great deals I want to share with you guys I did I'm, I'm really trying to get into the community tab and posting on there. I don't really post on on um, Instagram very often um, I want to but I don't y'all see my lace why did this rebate reset seven times? Dead ass. This is the seventh time I've done this deal. Mind you, we can't get the stacks anymore. But I'm doing two bags of these at $3 and then three of the small bags. So it's still making it like 99 cents for like two big bags and three little bags. So I'm still going to be doing it. Like I'm, yeah. I was surprised to see that it reset because normally... I bought us rebates because a lot of you guys asked me about this. They don't always reset, but if they do, and most often than not they do, you got to do it the first original time. It's going to reset four additional times. So ideally you're doing it five times combined. That lays, this is the seventh time I've done it, all right? And it just keeps resetting. So as long as the ship coupon is still valid, and it's still scanning your girl's gonna keep on doing that deal and I ordered another set so yeah I probably ordered like five sets of the coupon from different fairies because I like to spread the love always so I thought I was recording um, me doing the submissions because I was like I could do another video but I want to just kind of put it in, in, in this video right now um, and I'm not sure when I'll be able to do an updated um, or follow-up for the Alexa one but I submitted my Clorox receipt for $2 and it went straight through. Um, I had another receipt for the um, finish um, tabs for $1.50, went straight through. I'll insert some screenshots. So you scan your receipt, you scan your product just like coupons.com and then um, it processes like, and it went through, sh it went through really quick, like even faster than coupons.com because coupons.com be taking a long time sometimes but it went through really quick so now I have a gift card balance on Amazon for 350 which is really really cool right and so for me like I said I don't use Amazon that much but if I can get my ink and my paper my printer paper for the same price I do at Walmart then I will use um, Amazon for that are either that or do the brand club Amazon deals to kind of try to convert that back to cash um, because like I said with with um, coupons.com it goes back to cash you know um, and for now with Alexa for now it's only um, Amazon balance it goes towards your Amazon so um, and I don't necessarily see them changing that to any other form of payment um, because it's Alexa and it's Amazon so why wouldn't they want it to benefit themselves right and so I just wanted to kind of add that this snippet to this video because I don't know when I'll be able to do the follow up for you guys but to give you I mean this is a good like I mean it's cool like I freaking 
two new apps, you guys. And I understand y'all, some of y'all probably like, look, look, I can barely deal with the ones that I got. But listen, 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 listen. You guys, I'm telling, and I was just talking to one of you guys I bumped into um, at Walmart the other day. And she said she only uses two apps, Alibaba and like Fetch. I'm like, girl, girl, do you know how much money you are leaving on the table? Like you are leaving like so much money on the freaking table. Like to not be, I mean, and I understand it's overwhelming. I get it. I do. But when you realize how much money you guys are getting back on the back end from using the apps, OM freaking G. So don't sleep on the apps, you guys. Use them. Whether you use my referral, like I would love, I would love if you use my referral code and my links. I would love it. But to be honest, you don't have to. As long as you use the apps, as long as you download them and use them. Because I'm telling you, you're going to get so much money back. All right. And so to be adding two new apps to <laughs> my list of apps. I'm excited, you guys. I'm so excited. So I added, I would say in the last month, I've added Maryfield. I've added the Alexa, which I just, you know, started using today. And I have Flavor White Key. So to be adding three new apps, you guys, it makes my heart flutter. And it makes me so excited because it just makes, it just, it just, gosh, you guys know rebate apps are life and so i'm gonna leave it there because i am truly starting to ramble and i will see you guys in the next video if there are any other apps that you guys are using that you really love drop them in the comment section i don't i'm gonna tell you the ones i coin out no receipt hog no receipt hog no 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 those what those to me just move too slow for me too slow and i get it some of you guys are like, well, we just got to scan receipts. I get it. I get it. But three cents per receipt, I'm just like not cool with that. Like, I want things to move fast. As you know, I move fast. I like things to move really fast. Like, when we're dealing, you're dealing with a lot of these bigger apps where we really can make some really good money, then it's like, it makes me not want to deal with the smaller ones. But if you guys are using some apps that, um, that are pretty awesome that I don't use because I use a lot of them then drop them in the comment section and I will see you guys in the next video as always thank you guys so much for watching I'll see you guys in the next one I said that twice yeah okay bye guys